Hey people, what's up y'all? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So here I am and today I will tell you how you can create easily a website with the help of Squarespace service. So this video is going to be a reviewing video about this website builder service. What is this in general? How you can create this uh, site, your site or site for your customer for example. We will talk about the templates, all the features and tools. So don't forget about it. Check this video till the end. I'm waiting for your likes. I'm waiting for your personal opinion. I'm waiting for your comments. And let's start our business. So, Squarespace is great for artists, for photographers, for musicians, uh, even for you just to represent yourself. Uh, for anyone who loves design and wants uh, to create a website to look as good as the content they are showing offline. So this is where Squarespace shines and if you don't have high quality images or if you have a very heavy tax, I would say, uh, so you may struggle to make the most of Squarespace visual design uh, so talking about the pros of uh, this service I'm um, at the beginning of this video episode just to tell you that here we have stunning templates optimized for desktop optimized for tablet and for mobile devices uh, here we have a mobile app and I will tell you about this app a little bit later and of course uh, the ability to restore deleted posts and pages for up to 30 days and talking about the templates here we got this bottom this section and we will observe uh, the popular templates and um, the templates are uh, gorgeous and actually this is my lovely part of each reviewing video because you know uh, templates is uh, the most interesting part you know and uh, not in only in the video episode I mean just when you need to create your personal website you need to uh, you are looking for a template a template which will be good for your project how but because there you can represent your project your product your service or just yourself but uh, you will change there are some sections or you will you don't you you won't change some sections okay uh, so here we have actually many types uh, we have many categories of this uh, template such as portfolio blog photography local business restaurants events and others uh, but say we're gonna observe just uh, here what we got and this is my lovely part for example let's uh, check the preview right here preview events and uh, here we have in this preview uh we have three previews uh first is for the desktop the second one is for the tablet and the third one is for mobile devices so basically this is a very short template because we can check that here we have a header here we have main body uh and of course the footer so that is how it looks like that is uh, for the desktop and we can see that the borders, yeah, uh, we don't see them. Actually, this uh, tablet is uh, shorter and this is very slim, very thin template in my opinion, I would say. So we will start from this um, design. So uh, here we have, uh, actually this is the editor, but the extra information about the app. Uh, so with the Squarespace app, you can even edit your website from your phone directly and you know, this is a really cool thing because you uh, don't hold your uh, laptop everywhere every time, but you hold your phone 24 hours per 7, even when you're sleeping. So that is really nice and you there with this app, you can publish blogs, posts, update your business hours or add an announcement bar while you're on and about. And don't worry if you lost your internet because if you go offline and expectantly any unfinished work will still be waiting for you when you come back. And here we have, uh, actually, we will, uh, we will, actually we do this right now. Uh, we are talking about this is uh this tool these pictures this is the main menu of the editor so clicking directly to the pages pages are responsible for the layout uh, for what we got uh, we can add some pages, we can add some store portfolios, events, even some links. So basically this is uh, how it looks like. Uh, 
Uh, the second one is responsible for design. So basically we can get right here some animations, but basically in this template we have none animations, but we can add them or um, uh, colors. Uh, color palette of um, of this template, but we can change this color palette to the other one. Um, the next one, oh, excuse me, I'm moving so fast. Um, okay, to, uh, continue to get about the design. We have colors, animations, pasting fonts. So basically, fonts uh, here. Fonts are responsible for the task, uh, for the text, for, uh, for the base size of the text, for the headings, uh, bottoms, paragraphs, you know, uh, so for, so you can change the text, the text content directly right here. Um, the next we got bottoms, uh, image blocks. So here, um, each section is responsible for design. Uh, okay, the next one is commerce and what I can add about commerce. Uh, so basically this is main features of um, the commerce right here, uh, which is responsible for orders, customers, discounts, uh, but this is not a website so I cannot demonstrate you right this um, in this moment, but you have to know that you have um, features such as payments, checkout, related products and you know Squarespace um, offers numerous useful tools that is right here yep and actually uh, these tools are everywhere just to build your personal uh, website attractive uh, functional and you know that is, it is aimed for small businesses uh, and I can say that Squarespace is a well-known and respected product in the West and I would say one of the best and it is actually an all constructor with a long history of development a good budget uh, advertising with the good um, you know participation of business uh, stars so uh, we can check it in on the internet uh, because there are many information there are many sites uh, where, where we can observe it and you know uh, we then establish um, audience of followers so on functionality, it is really good and in places it surprises with the depths of elaboration of nuances, but in general it does not make any kind of revolution. And we have three uh, plans right here. The first plan is uh, for $12 per month, the second one is for $18 per month, and the last one is about $26 per month. Um, what we're gonna do, uh, the next actually will continue, so here uh, we will add it our um, our template directly. Uh, so um, uh, mm -hmm, here we have actually this. Uh, I guess that this video is gonna be very short reviewing because uh, not very short because we have uh, many 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 images. Oh, okay, that's nice. So here we have a header editing clicking directly to this bottom of header we have main settings so this is for the desktop that is for the tablet and that is for mobile phones here we can successfully upload the logo uh, we would like to but unfortunately I don't have a logo I'm just making a reviewing uh, video for you but you may try to do this here we can change the title but so basically I will left only this one so you can check how it looks like the next elements which um, for example I may add bottom okay um, and of course the color is so the color may be like in this way or this way or just okay I need to wait just a little or in dark way or in black way yep okay let it say in black way so basically that clicking directly to this section you can change you will change you work with this um, section uh, so I would say that you know it looks like in WordPress and uh, you know um, 
Press page is more straightforward than Wix or lead pages for because you know lead pages and Wix are drag and drop editors. Here we can drag some elements to the other ones to change different location. But right here we don't have this opportunity. We are working directly with uh, each section with the element, and we have cell options, and we select the option that, in our opinion, best fits our to our template, let it be like in this one. Okay, we can directly write here. So basically we will work with the text so we can change the, to this one or just this one if maybe, uh, but you know, okay. So I forgot, format, okay. So that is how it looks like. Okay, I guess that it looks better. So basically, you know, it looks like in a board. Um, okay, so here we have the other settings, but this was settings um, to the text, and this was this is settings uh, for actually for this section. And just here we have the format. We can make it medium, small, or large. Change the background. Uh, change the location. Maybe like here, here, here. So you will play with this one. Yep. Um, we can replace the image. I guess that I will do the same. So I can upload the image, the other one from my laptop, and let's try to do this. So um, people are preferred to use uh, to select this image from my laptop uh, from my previous uh, project, and I guess that it's nice right here. So the same we can add it we have the editor for the images right here and of course we can directly edit the image uh, like uh, like boss for the instagram yeah so it may look like just in this way and let's say all the settings so basically that is how you can edit a template how you can create uh, your personal website just uh, you you see can, that you just need to have your personal images portfolio your imagination and just a little bit of practice and I assure you that everything will be nice okay um, so actually that is how it looks like uh, you know talking about uh, Cross, I told you that here we have beautiful responsive design and designs for the tablet, for mobile phones, uh, for desktops. We have the application, which is uh, good for um, which is good for your work, even if you don't hold your uh, laptop mm, every time everywhere with you. You have deep selling capabilities, including digital downloads, you have marketing tools, analytics, which is uh, multi-level, which is really powerful and it's nice. So I, I highly recommend you just to taste Squarespace, maybe it will fit your needs, yeah? And of course, Squarespace pages are made up of sections, yeah? So we can check that here, we have many sections. And you know, uh, sections are a quick way to lay out a page without designing it from scratch. They stack vertically on a page and pre-design containers of content blocks. So basically they are content blocks. And here we have content blocks. You know, content blocks are the building blocks. Actually, these are tags, buttons, images, maps, and more. So in Squarespace, you know, web pages consist of responsive sections, consists of blocks. So uh, it's it's much more, I would say, straightforward than Wix, and it's not a um, drag and drop editor. So actually, this is the end of my review and video. I'm waiting for your likes, I'm waiting for your comments, I'm waiting for your personal opinion as usual. Please write me how you tested actually Squarespace, or would you like to test it after watching my review and video. And I guess that we will see each other in another video episode uh, where I will compare some website builder services and we will see what, uh, in my personal opinion, which of this website builder service is the best. So uh, I assure you it will be interesting as usual. Bye and thank you for your attention.